in Black Friday fashion, CSUB fans got two for the price of one today with a men's and women's basketball doubleheader. The Lady Runners were taking on San Jose State in the early game and they did not start hot. The Spartans ended the first quarter on a 12-0 run and led by eight. But CSUB bounced back in the second half. The three balls started dropping for the runners, hitting five of nine. Despite being in foul trouble, the defense became shut down, holding San Jose to less than 17% from the floor in the second. A close win against a good team says a lot to Coach McCall. It shows a lot of character, shows that we can win at crunch time. We're still learning each other. We still got a lot of new players that we're still learning, uh, but it shows a lot of character, a lot of gutsy performances by some players. In game two, the men took on the Hampton Pirates and controlled this one the entire way. Coming in on a three game losing streak, Cal State Bakersfield needed a bounce back game and got it. Leading by as much as 24 in this one, Taze Moore led the charge with 16 and Justin McCall added buckets with his dad sticking around to see. Of course, no Black Friday would be complete without a little bit of chippiness and a fight here and there. Against JD Fair, JD Fair real hard after number three like pulled him down and then it was just a scuffle. It wasn't a bunch of little taps. For head coach Rod Barnes, a win like this can open up some eyes. We were playing well, and we haven't played well. Like, I think we're capable of playing. So I started feeling good because I said this is a glimpse of our team, you know, that I kind of envisioned that, you know, we would have different guys scoring and uh, being able to play a lot of people. And, be a very versatile team. The men will be right back on the court tomorrow night for a 7 o'clock tip off while the women have the weekend off and will take the court on Monday. At the Icardo Center, I'm Matt Lively for 23 ABC Sports, connecting you.